we're in Parkgate, which is nice. Going to a few beaches, four or five beaches, on a bit of a mission to find out what's the best beach on the Wirral Peninsula, essentially. Um, Callum, give us a fact about the Wirral. Quick fact about the Wirral. Central Park in New York was based on Birkenhead Park. Boom. Actual fact? Yeah. Wow. It's impressive. Uh, what's the first beach? Thurstiston. 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 Say again? Thurstiston. Say again? Thurstiston. How many minutes are we away? Twelve. Twelve minutes away? Was, um, it's the birthplace and it's it's the it's the actual beach, the setting of the film Chariots of Fire. <laughs> Running along here to the to the Chariots of Fire music. Incredible. Overall out of 10, I'd say 6 out of 10 beach. This bit's great. Back there there was a lot of poo and sludge, so that took it down a notch. Sturdy, I'd give, I'd give it a, a 6 out of 10. I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. The world has moved again since then. So, this is, uh, we're in West Kirby. West Kirby. West Kirby. West Kirby. <laughs> West Kirby. West Kirby. West Kirby. Not to be, not to be confused with, shop or something. not to be confused with Kirby. This is, this is an absolute walk. <laughs> fact for you um, that um, first ever um, swim from here to Wales over there happened just 10 years ago Six out of ten for me. I'm gonna give it seven out of ten. I'll give it a six out of ten. Um, I like all these patterns on the floor around here. Um, yeah. So this is Liso Beach. Um, over there, that furthermost windmill uh, is owned by Kevin McLeod of Grand Designs uh, and he lives in there from April to September. So the lighthouse is, um, it's got five no, hang on. Six floors. Has it? Yeah. It's no longer functioning. It went out of service a number of years ago. Mm.
Right then, Lizo Beach, concrete jungle. Uh, nice views though, six out of 10. Five out of 10 for me, quiet. Nice bit of alternative surfacing up here with the, uh, with the grasses. To be honest, I'd give it a, a four. Um, four, four yeah. from Rob. Wind farm, absolute eyesore. Yeah, I think you're right. But then you've got a sweet lighthouse over there, which, which, uh, which I've learned that there's, there's like a, a sun deck on it, which is, which is pretty cool. So, yeah, that's what bumps it up to four. First a lighthouse uh, in the UK, apparently. Was it? Yeah. Wow. Just saying it, that's wow. actually out of service now. It's out of service. New Brighton, not Brighton, New Brighton, because it's newer. What are you popping on there, Al? Just popping a fleece on just underneath my coat, just getting a bit nippy. Enjoying this one, nice lighthouse. <laughs> oh! Quite an important fact for the area, this one. Um, this is where uh, John Lennon uh, from the from the Beatles actually wrote "Let It Be" just on just over there. On a, a night a bit like this, I think I believe. Well, there's this girl and she's fly. She's so into this guy. I know that I'm better, but she can't see what's inside. She sees Jordan tonight. I see that shit in her eyes. Materialism on the highest degree. The type of girl who gets married just for the ring. Oh, but that shit don't faze me. He might be cool, but I'm amazing. Yeah, because might be swole, but at least I know how to show myself. Absolutely spot on this beach. What a place. What a concept. Six out of ten. It's a six out of ten for me as well. It's pretty clean. Pretty clean beach considering it borders the River Mersey. This is definitely eight going on nine for me. I, I, Liverpool's there. You've got a lighthouse there. Like I've, I've not seen a lighthouse like that since, since the lighthouse family. Yeah, because I'm cool. Fresher than the first day of school. I spend my days observing things and making all the ladies cool. Oh, I think I am, but she's too busy. It's been a long day. It's been very long. <laughs> Should we get some chips? Should we get it? Yeah, come on. It's been a good day. Yeah. I'm so knackered. I'm <laughs> so hungry. Nice. Well and truly deserved. <laughs>